This chapter discuss about clinical features, diagnosis, and management of Votko Yunogi Harder disease. Votko Yunogi Harder disease, VKHD, initially described as an uveomeningoencephalitic syndrome, is a systemic granulomatous autoimmune disease that targets melanocyte-rich tissues, such as the eye, inner ear, meninges, skin and hair. VKHD is difficult to diagnose because its clinical presentation is variable and multisystemic which often leads to late diagnosis and treatment allowing the appearance and progression of the disease sequelae. We report a 35-year-old female presented to our hospital with chief complaints of pain, redness, and progressive diminution of vision in both eyes for two years. Early referral to tertiary centers should be the golden rule, as delay in initiation of treatment can lead to secondary complications such as serous retinal detachment, cataract, glaucoma, choroidal. As VKHD is a progressive, rare, and multisystemic disease with variable outcomes, an early diagnosis and treatment play a significant role in deciding the fate of the patient. Primary health workers, being the ones to have the first contact with such patients, should be more aware of such syndromic multisystemic diseases and diligent while dealing with such patients. Early referral to tertiary centers should be the golden rule, as delay in initiation of treatment can lead to secondary complications such as serous retinal detachment, cataract, glaucoma, choroidal neovascularization, and sensory neural hearing loss, some of which may be irreversible. Moreover, in all the cases presenting with pain and redness to the eye department, fundoscopy should be done invariably, to rule out posterior segment involvement, 